uh, 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 uh. Sorry guys, I just realised uh, well, my, my, um, uh, my audio has been muted for uh, for at least two and a half uh, minutes, so we'll start uh, that again. Uh, welcome to the welcome to the uh, video. We're going to be rolling as uh, medic 59 for tonight's patrol, and then in the second hour we'll be going. We will be going as um, BCSO law enforcement. So uh, yeah, let's see what let's hey, see what happens. Call here coming up. Uh, what? Uh, oh damn! I'm looking on Twitter, I saw somebody tweeted. They were like, "Yeah, my there's an avalanche on the hey, south Reaper. side of Chiliad, and my yep. friend didn't make it out." Yeah, we we don't have oh, a. Uh, I don't there's see no a dispatcher. dispatcher. Okay. Not for 19. Oh, we might want to ask about it. Ah, uh, okay. Got one coming down. Twenty-nine, San Andreas fire. Here we go. Go ahead. Beatbox, we're receiving 911 call, possible avalanche, possible SAR operation, 1088, 1088 on Mount Chiliad at this time. We have units in boot, no further details known. Well, Zero let eight. you know as soon as I know. Uh, Copy. Medic 5, can you respond to that call? Tower 5, you as well. Nope, Medic we're, stick it. we're staying put, responding. guys. Uh, yeah, did you get air up for it? Yeah, yeah he's, uh, CR2. Delta 229, Medic 5, Postal okay. 20, 1088, 1088. 10 Alright, um, let's do... You want me and John to take uh, the starboard up and just combined, uh, you can see No, John, stay with Medic in case another Medic call comes in. Um, I'll take, uh... Who's with you, uh, Hendo? Is it Davis? Oh, remember SAR uh, three. Uh, yeah, I'm with Hendo. Okay. Yeah, um, David Davis is with me. All right, Davis, uh, you stay on tower. You go out to that call. John, you come with me. Stanford, you stay here in case engine needs to go out with medic 59 on another medical call. Do you want me to call. go on tower or rescue? Um, either or. Doesn't matter. Tower of rescue is fine. Well, I, I'm on uh, 59, so if you want to. a little bit more appropriate, but. Yeah, I'm on medic 59 anyway, so, uh, yeah. Yeah, Shield, uh, you stay you here with uh, John. I thought John was going with you. Alright, so you want. Sorry, I meant Hendo. Okay. Hendo comes uh, with me. I'm gonna go <laughs> grab uh, rescue 28. All right. I'll be back. Alright, Hendo, let's go. <laughs> Love to yell. What are we taking? Uh. Are we going to get the bird up? I'm happy to certified. Do you want to take tower 5 to the helipads and then tower 5 can then push on to the SAR call no, if needed? No, because you're taking, you're taking tower out. Yep. You can't do that. They just need to pull out the spec ops vehicle and go. Yeah, we've got rescue Yeah, ops, sorry, so rescue. Yeah, rescue 28. Oh, do you know how avalanche release this is? Uh. One of the doors off of engine just fell off. What in the? Was the postal for that last call? Be one zero eight eight. Should we? Hey, hey John. Thank you. Who kind of? Firefighter thirty four. Firefighter twenty nine. Hey, John. Thirty four. Should we? Where are you? Should we go mobile oh, and back, just getting, uh, go around rescue L ops. LS City there. then, in case. Should Copy. I already got one out. Oh, we're good. Ten four. We coming to you. Can wait here. Do you know what kind of 34 be advised on at the side in the parking lot? Bye, have a good time! Medic 5, Firefighter 29 direct. Go. <coughs> right, well, I'm gonna get in the wall. Oh, darn, how it's only game warden. 20 from 34, <laughs> uh, 10 you going LEO second patrol. May want yeah, to think uh, about yeah, same air mind. med uh, if uh, anyone's available for Yo, but I want to know what kind of I'm like. 10 4, we've got. Is. Can I we've got a it. slab, snow, or uh, storm, wind? I'm, I'm guessing it's snow. Which is keeping dangerous. 
I know it's so, but I don't know more than what type of what's causing it, the wind. Yeah, that's a good or challenge. Snow, actually. I'm sorry if I'm kind of nerdy now and you have a Abbey 3 certification and just got it, so that's kind of fun <laughs> for me. You're alright, mate. It's always good to be passionate about the job. Don't ask John, I don't know either. <coughs> oh dear. Oh no either. Fuck it, I might as well just go run around. Whew. <coughs> No. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Hang on. Stanford, do that dance again. Alright, just hold that there for one sec. I love. Say again. Go and speak it. Strange. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna go uh, in my head for a minute. So, um, yeah, if we get any calls, then tell John he's driving. For a non firefighter 10. Go ahead. You got medics available? Yes, medic 59. You get medics en route to Mission Row. Person shot. 10 4. Engine 5, medic 5, 9. Go ahead. Be advised, well, I'll 97 with you. 10 4. 4 to 9, firefighter 10. It's going to be a one male upper GSW to the right side in the upper abdomen. Alright. So, meta 59 in route. Pulse is high. Well, we get a GSW. Magic 59 to 349. Go ahead. 
Is this gonna be in front of the station or in the back? In front. Oh, it's so mad 59 on scene. Hey, just slide in right here. Hey, I'm record. Hi, guys. Grab the medic ball. Yep. Follow me. What did you get into? <clears throat> All right, okay. So I get a vital set up and I'll check the injuries. Does anything? Just ask. Hey, where's everyone else at, Marn? This is everyone. All the other officers are out at uh, various uh, instances of shots fired and pursuits. All right, I'm gonna go check in on that. Shit. I gotta go. I'll be back. Okay, Mike. Hey, mate, can you, uh, can you sign your name to me at all? Can you hear me? <coughs> Xavier? Jesus Christ, dude. What happened to you? Didn't think I'll be seeing you in, on this on uh, this side of the job. Jesus Christ! Yeah, Roger that, mate. No, no one. All right, I'll just, uh, take your um to pillbox. Yeah, Roger that, mate. <coughs> All right, away you go. So, medic fifty nine priority to the pillbox. One time, peach. Okay, mate, I think I've got him stable here, so uh, I'll just keep an eye out on him. 49 to the uh, engine that was following me earlier. Go ahead. We're currently at 7296. <laughs> Area seems calm. If you clue to roll, and I have three officers down. Right, looks like we're going to bounce to uh, five in route. that next job five, then. Uh, 29, Medic 5, yep. or Medic 59. Medic 59 is... Alright, staff, we've got one, uh, one Xavier Detman, two G, uh, sorry, one GSW to the left abdomen. Uh, currently, had, uh, when arrived, he had shallow breathing and a high pulse, which started to lower. We've got him stabilized now, so uh, should be over to you for further treatment. I believe the bullet was a through and through. Um, that's a credible medical history with yourselves, so uh, yeah, it should be known to you fairly well. <coughs> yep. All right, let's uh, yeah, let's bounce that next call. 
What what was the po <coughs> what was the postal on it? Three officers down. Yeah, postal. Yeah, what was the, what was the postal, John? It's seven nine two six. Seven nine two six. I'll get that up now. Okay, that's uh, right there. You got it on your GPS? <coughs> Show medic 59 dropped off a patient at the pillbox medical center. We're now bouncing to the uh, officer down call. Medic 59, we're going to be in attendance at uh, 7926. Be advised we're currently attempting to locate the scene. You definitely said, was it 7926? Yeah. Uh, Satnav was saying nearest postal was seven zero two six, not seven nine two six. Stand by. Medic fifty nine to uh, any units attached to this uh, three officers down call. Can we get a confirmation on the postcode, please? Medic 59 to uh, units attending the officers down call. Can we get a confirmation on the postcode, please? Tip for the post is going to be 7296. You're going to see the, it's going to be at the corner of Glory Way and Poplars. 10 4, show us mobile to incident. You got uh, tabs on the route there, John. Medic 5 to see commands. Go ahead, Med 5. I've just seen a kid running up the middle of the highway. Uh, I'm to break off and check. <laughs> medic uh, currently, we don't have any. We only have one medic on scene. If we could get you here. Rest Med yeah, Medic 59, be advised, we're actually eastbound Del Perro Freeway. We can uh, swing by the area where you saw the child if needed. No, no, we have to go to the cop. Come on. Okay. Medic 59, cancel last. 
I was going to say, if we just scoop him up and take him along with us, then at least Ripley, we can bring him to Ripley. Now we only have three officers down. Yeah, Raj. Oh my god, my spectacles. Here we are on the left there. Um, I got out over here. Okay. Where'd Brandon go? Which, which officers need trip. attention? Brandon, come All here. three are being attended. I want the most critical and the medic first. Rog. Say Corporal Corey, who's Smith. your patient? Right here in front of me. Okay, and where's the third one? I believe there's one over by the charger and... Yeah, that was Chief. Third, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, third, yeah. uh, Zena's had he could serve. Oh, 10 four. Okay. okay. Alright, Smith, let's get you in the back of Medic 5 here. Yep. Oh, I get the other one. Yeah. Are you the other one needs needs, uh, treatment, sir? So? Silver? Oh, there you go. I've been treated by, uh... I've been treated, yeah. Hey. Right. Do you wanna... What's... what's... what... what's your injuries at the minute? Uh, just one through and through to the right shoulder, nothing vital here that I had, uh, Stanford have a look over it and just check it. Alright, okay. Um... Of course, it's just elevated, breathing normal. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, just because it's... You we're a... gonna want you to go. Just because it's yeah, through to the shoulder. To the yeah, because it's through to the shoulder of all places. Probably best you come with us, Chief. That, that's what I said. I said I can walk myself. Don't need like carrying yeah. or anything like that. Yeah, Rog. Yeah, okay. Right. Medic by I get to the back one. of Medic. Medic 5 is in service from Billbuck. Alright, Chief's looking in overall good condition considering. Um, Hopefully the shoulder doesn't, hopefully the shoulder heals up properly. That should be, it's not the first time I've been shot like that. Yeah, but I just, I'm just concerned if it's uh, gone through the actual joint itself or if it's just hit the flesh. Well, I mean, it hurts when I move it, so I mean, at least I can still move it, right? Yeah, well, there is that. Yeah, I'll be fine, don't worry about me. Well, here's hoping. How did you get a shot, anyways? Uh, sniper rifle. So medic for denying arriving at pill. Basically, what happened is uh, you know Smith, the guy who got shot in the butt. Yeah, no, because uh, we weren't treating Smith. But go ahead. Yeah, yeah, dude got shot in the butt. He shot uh, the sniper shot him through the butt. Um, the bullet refracted through his body and then it whacked up in my right shoulder. I don't ask how it went that elevated though. <laughs> Jesus. So you pretty much shoulder. have his butt on you. Ugh. Uh, I've got his butt bullets, if that's what you yeah. Alright, staff, we got, uh... I don't have it, it went through. We got the deputy chief here, he's taken a ricochet through the shoulder from a sniper round. Uh, all conditions are stable at this time. Um, hopefully he's going to make a full recovery. But, uh, yeah, we'll leave the fine treatment over to you people. Show medic 59 back at quarters. Welcome back, guys. That was uh, crazy, huh? Well, Deputy Sh Chief is going to regret dude. abandoning us yeah. for PD, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> all right. He's probably having to deal with all that shit right now. It's, the, it's, the, it's not even did. the fact that it, he got shot. It's the fact that it was a ricochet bullet that came out of one of his partner's asses. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's you. 
Well, so that, that's what he's that, that wound. that's what he's told me. That's hilarious. I uh, well, I I I was like, I'm not sure whether to believe you or not at this point. But yeah, it's uh, if it was, then it's certainly an interesting story. That's for sure. Uh, that'll do. Right, just alt tab here, guys, to uh, get into BCSO RTI. There we go. Now we just got to quickly log out and re-log into CAD as. Um, as BCSO guys. Now, uh, the BCSO just recently underwent a call sign change, so uh, I'm going to be using a new call sign Delta 236. Um, a lot of others had to um, change their unit numbers as well. Luckily, mine was it within the margin, so I was able to uh, stay as 236. But uh, yeah, if you hear a lot of new unit numbers, we haven't got new people, guys. Those are just reassigned unit numbers. That is all. Right, so let's go ahead and uh, let's get the patrol silver armor out because we can. Two thirty six, go ahead, show me ten forty one ten eight. Delta two twenty nine, Sam two oh eight. Come on, Ripley, I don't okay. have all day. Be advised, I'll be going forty two at the time, Rob. I had to get fleet maintenance to quite much. Hey, did my... you see a guy running back there? Uh, uh, yes, mate, what's up? Main. Yeah, yeah, he's maintenance to pick it up. Fine. Oh, Corey, come up. Uh, uh, local. It's just yeah, it's just Taylor. He's a local that lives around here. Yeah, Tyler lives around here, yeah, mate. We're all good. Figures. Look like he come running out of that store. Alright, I'll go have a word with him if I see him. Was he two away? We'll be back tonight. Uh, come on. <laughs> I love harassing Ripley with the uh, PA system. Alright, we'll go have a word with uh, James here because I know I know James from previous encounters, so we'll see if we can. Uh, he, he, he lives at the tattoo shop along with uh, Morgan here, so we'll go ahead and see if we can uh, get in touch with him. <laughs> Two oh eight. Do we have a unit in the area of one zero four seven? Two oh two. Could you head up to uh, around the area, Pluto Bay uh, Mental Hospital one zero four seven? You report a uh, escaped mental patient. Uh, we're gonna attempt to gather further intel. Head two. Don't you twenty three to Sierra two oh eight? Go ahead. We advise I'm currently in Pluto Bay. If you like to respond. Ah, uh, ten four. You can go ahead and respond as well. Code two. Whoops. Did not mean to put a slash at the beginning of that. So, go hello. To Anyone home? Why would they be like that? 
I reckon they may have found James Tyler then. Just quickly. Life. Hmm. Kelly Blur. Okay. Two eight units on the call at one zero four seven. Escape mental patient. Uh, got additional information. Uh, people's gonna have a black hospital gown, pinks and pink slippers. And what? Stay up to a four. I'll be on a tunnel of Madrid Downs in Shasha Road on a four door black and colored bike. Is that you, maybe. Shield? It is, mate. What's the problem? Yeah, this kid ran he right out in front of the Medicare. He just handed me a phone saying something about Two Guile eight. 6. 2 8 from 34. Can we have Do a deputy roll to 3006? We had Medic 5 involved in an NBA Hang with on a pedestrian. I got a call to send. 236 break. Currently on scene with them at this time. Yeah, sorry, go ahead. 34, 34, 10 1 back to fire. He handed me this phone and he said something about dialing number 6. Okay, mate, let me, uh, I'll check it out. Hi up James, is that you mate? 204, or stand 204, can I get an additional unit right, on the okay. Two, um, uh, you say a deal? Yeah, it's on four, I got a deal. Right, okay mate. And four. Just stick um, with us. In route, go. Do you wanna help me get this backboard on him? Yeah, Roger, mate. I was just about to get a foil blanket around him if you need. Yeah, I want to get a blanket, backboard, and then could you do me a favor and check on oh. Ripley and the medic? Is she okay? Uh, she's pretty well shaken up. I got two guys coming up here. Okay, mate. All right, Tyler, just stay with me, mate. There we go, let's get him on this backboard. Okay, mate. Right, zero, he's got zero, my high vis jacket as a pillow as well. Perfect. I'm place a C collar side. on, game secured to it. Rip, you alright? I, I hit a kid. Yeah, don't worry. Alright, he's gonna be okay. Alright. Best thing you can do now is. I was going the speed limit, I wasn't I, speeding. I know, I know, look. It's happened. You can't change that, all right? You're an ex-lieutenant, and you're on EMS on Medic Five. We gotta get, we gotta get you to uh, help him out, okay? We've got, we've got others helping, but honestly, the best. Look, just chill out and breathe, okay? There's nothing, there's nothing that you know you could have done, or nothing that can be changed now, okay? 
Just calm hey, down. Hey, Shield, do quick me a sec. favor. Can, can you help me lift him under the car? Yeah. Yeah, we'll do, mate. Right, Ripley, parking brake on. Put it in neutral, all right? Yeah, what's up, Corey? Just help me lift him up under the cot so we can get him into the medic. And I can keep him warm and protected yeah. in there a lot easier. Look, I'll be honest, mate. It's probably best not have a Ripley drive him. Uh, drive to pillbox, okay? No, I've, I've, got, a, I've got a second uh, person nice coming one. with engine to drive me. Okay, perfect. I'll All right. have you take care of Ripley for me. Yeah, no dramas. Right, um, you want to go on my instruction? Hang on, mate, hang on, hang on. He's got bleeding coming yeah, from his fine. right pocket. Hang on. James, I'm just going to undo your trousers oh, here, mate. Crap. Nothing untowards. I just want to, uh, I just want to check, see where that bleeding's coming from, pal. Do mark him down. Oh my, I just gotta clear some of the cloth here because it's, fu it's fucking saturated with blood here. Hey, yeah. it's alright. Yeah, uh, Sarge, could you check on uh, Rip, please? She's a bit shaken up. Oh, uh, sure, where's she at? She's uh, still in Medic 5 in the driver's seat. Okay. Ripley. I'm just showing up, because... Moss, is this you? What do you find there? Oh, shit. Yep, you're damn right. Right, Blake. hang on, right, hang on. Oh, let's secure that. Right, I've got that, right, I've got that from my belt. Hang on, sorry James, it's gonna hurt. Uh, the medic, okay? Golf, Get on there! Right. Okay. Right. Wait, I hit the kid. No, I just... Didn't mean to. No, no, no. Right, there we go. Alright, okay. right, James. Five, James, we're actually okay. Right, no, right, what Corey. I need, I need someone to get Ripley out of the driver's seat. She's out, mate, she's out. someone needs to drive me to... Okay. Pillbox. Right, Moss, get on medic... Get on medic five. Corey, I'll uh, drive. Oh my god. Oh, stuff. Alright, huh. thanks, Moss. Sarge, are you able to get on that? Alright, Shield, you ready to lift? Yes, mate, just one sec, just one sec. 2 2 to 204. Someone stop that vehicle that just went past you. Okay. I raised right. speed. 10 4 2 2 0, handle yeah, this. You got it. Uh, be advised, you have two more vehicles going that way, both under glow, possibly in relation to a street raid. Okay, why don't you tell me what happened? What did the black muscle car do with the big disarray? Uh, he got, got the strike of okay, okay, right. that vehicle. Uh, All right, that blade secured as best I can. Here with medics, uh, off road at a high rate of speed. All right, be advised, tourniquet is going to be applied over 36 hours. From me, stand by. You ran a stop sign. 10 4, we might break and roll here in a minute. Ready on you, Vipa. Okay, I might. Uh, I might break and roll here, uh, cause they're still trying right, to ready. capture okay. someone. Ready? I'll be back in a second. Alright, okay. One. Corey on me. Ready, Two. brace, and lift. Yep. Alright James, everything's gonna be alright mate. We're gonna Two pull you through. Lost I'm, it's gonna be a right, I'm sorry I know that TQ people hurts, people but we gotta yeah, keep it there to stop you from bleeding. I got him right here. Corey, am I right to uh, grab a... Corey, am I right to grab a spare TQ from Medic 5 real quick? Yeah, go ahead. I'm gonna break here then. Uh, units are doing some stuff over there at the gas station. Okay. 2 we're gonna break and roll. Rip, you alright, hon? Moss, when you're ready, just roll straight to pillbox. BBM take, gotcha. Okay, he's in, he's in. Alright, let's roll. Ripley, I need you to tell yeah. me what happened, okay? We just got fuel at the gas station. It's gonna be eastbound, east Joshua, bro. And Update on the description, it's not gonna be a black one, it's gonna be a I, red one. I, I stopped at the junction down there. Start. 
pulled out. So it will be third speed limit, and when I literally got to bed, there's a tree. The kid ran out. Just Opposite ran out to travel towards Fleet on. I didn't have time to stop. Okay. These southbound lanes, I'm gonna be, or he's gonna be heading uh, north. I slammed on, but it was too late. Insane. He was already in the middle of the road, and we driven past him. Okay. It's okay. They got him. They're taking him to the hospital. Seems like he's stable. So you didn't. You didn't do anything. Are you calling for two or two or two? Ran out in the middle of the road. You did your best to try and avoid him. Rip, I'm not being funny, right? But you've got barely any lighting on on this road, and if he's not got any reflective kit, there's no more you could have done, right? He flipped around. I've run into I've run into James loads of times. He's known for just wandering about and going places he shouldn't be going. I've caught him at least twice in the abandoned motel when he shouldn't be, so just chill out, honestly. You'll be alright. Buzz, he made a right-hand right turn quickly. off the dirt road. I've just got to quickly make a call, so, um, yeah. I've, I've got to quickly make a call just to let, um, just to let James's mother know, adopted mother, that, uh, he's been involved in an injury, or in an yeah, accident. Yeah, on southbound, the Great Ocean. Um, or, I'll, uh, yeah. I'll... Let you know. I'll let you know how that goes. Left and, uh, turn yeah. off CDU. Just sit tight here. Don't sit out here in the cold. If you want, you can sit in my Silverado or an engine. It's not a problem. Two, 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 four. Richard, come on, set. Ripley. I'll help you up. Stand by. Silverado. Oh God. Sorry. Muscle spasm. Well, somebody's gonna give me a kick in the ass. All right. right. You know, South Bunny Shasher. No, it's just He's slippy on slippy on the side now. of the road. Come on, Ripley. 204, continue for him. I'm gonna activate Foxtrot. I'll help you to the truck. Copy. Right in westbound on uh, dirt road, parallel to the East Joshua. 220. I'm so sorry, I'm gonna... I tried. Go ahead. Well, I'm just, I'm just gonna pull the just engine over do, uh, want me to write this guy a you guys, that's gonna be officer's discretion, no, depending worry. on how much you blew, I'm gonna be on westbound. And four. Right hand turn onto Grand Arama, we're now on the motel. Right, Rip, I'm gonna be in my head for a Back short on, while, on, if on. you know what I mean, but uh, Reap will take care of you for the meantime. He's going back into the motel parking lot. He's gonna be going. Hi, is that, uh, is that Morgan? Yeah. Hi, Morgan, it's, uh, Deputy Will Shield here with the Blaine County Sheriff's Office. How you doing? I'm stressed as hell. It it's been a long of couple right? of days. Yeah, what, what's happened? Uh, I don't know. I'll well, don't first, James decides to be done. friends with people that are less than normal. Like, okay. on the shady scale. So, I'm definitely right. gonna, uh, I go with them down gonna, to the city, go well not shift, with them, but after them, down to the city, where people get shot outside the station. Right, okay. Shift, but I'll stay at I come back up here, have like, supper, and he runs off again. We're in the hospital, the house would be alone anyway. What, he's, he's run off again? Okay. Yeah, he ran off. Okay, did you report this to BCSO at the time? No, because it hasn't been more than 24 hours. Okay, fair enough. Um, Morgan, at this time, James is actually on his way to hospital. He's been involved in a, um, he's, he's been struck by a vehicle at this time. Like I said, it wasn't your fault. Everything, at the minute, um, the guy from ran, what the I can tell, ran in the middle of the road. Like, you can't he see anything should be okay, but he's not in a great condition. Um, it's when he hit the vehicle, um, when he hit the vehicle, uh, he was carrying his blade on him, and that has actually gone into his leg um, upon the impact. We've managed to get it tourniqueted and uh, hey, stemmed sure the bleeding considerably, sure um, but at the minute I can't say what condition he's going to be in. Um, all I know is that he's on his way to Pillbox Medical, okay? Oh. 
Um, like it was accidental, where so where are you at the minute? Because if needed, I can come pick you up and uh, take you to pillbox unless uh, you've Probably. got your own means of getting there. I don't I don't see you losing your job over there. I'm at the tattoo shop. You weren't at the fault. tattoo shop. Okay. You did everything you could to try and avoid the person. Okay. Um. What I'll do is I'll come I'll come by briefly to. Uh, pick you up, are you going to be there all day? Yeah. Okay, look, I know this maybe is a shock, but try not to try not to worry yourself too much about it, um, because obviously, like I say, um, you know, medics were near enough instantly att instantly tending to him, and I saw it, and I was only around the corner, so uh, I, I came as well, and obviously I know James and all that. Um, just real quick, he handed one of the paramedics on scene a phone and was trying to ask them to speed dial number six does that mean anything to you at all that's my phone number okay right um so he's probably trying to let you know then um what i'll do is i'll come pick you up uh i'll come pick you up now i'll make my way to you now um and Ripley. i'll take you to pillbox you need to take a couple big breaths, okay? Alright. Is there any questions you got for me? You get your breathing under control. Um, no, not right now. Are you sure? Positive. Oh, oh god. Um, I've got a panic button activation, so I'm gonna need to, uh... I'm gonna need to end this call real quick. Cause, uh... Alright. Yeah. I'm sorry, I've got to go. That, that will do what you need bring to your do. heart rate... Guys, guys, I'm really sorry. I need you out. I need you out right now. I've got a panic button activation at that gas station there. Okay, uh, are you going to be pressing charges? Uh, I'll, I'll let you know. I'm not far away. Okay, I'm going to take her back to the station. Out. Yeah, um, yeah, keep her at station 7 for the time being, and I'll be there with you shortly. Okay, Ripley, come on, hop in the engine. 236, show me responding to that panic button activation on figures for you. God damn it. Two thirty six in attendance at this time. Stanford? Stanford, where you at? Twenty back then. Uh Stanford, call out. Where are you? Uh, car. Car. Oh shit. Uh. Jesus Christ. Two thirty six. Be advised, two twenty three's car is burnt out and he's upside down on his roof, still entrapped. Can we get FD and medics to break and roll now? Be advised, first aid in progress at this time. Actually, I wanted to do a two. Two be on a 1011 Marina Drive, 3010, with a black and color buff or a Foxtrot 1202. Are we clear to break off this time? Right, Stanford, I'm sorry, but I've Foxtrot got to get you out of the, the car RTD. here, mate. This might hurt a bit. Two thirty six, if I can get anyone at all to help me. Um we're at the gas station at this time. I'm currently got first aid on two twenty three. Be advised injuries include third degree burns, a broken arm and a broken leg, along with uh 
a lot of bleeding at this time. 39, 36, I'll be uh, 10 eight shortly. I'll head that way. 10 4, appreciate it. Pasha, when you can show us same traffic once we uh, land here. 236 to Foxtrot 1. Is it possible I can transport two, uh, 233 to Sandy Shores Airfield and you could airlift him to pillbox at this time? I'm going to do the best I can for medical before transporting him, but he is in a very bad state. Uh, do we have fire en route? Not that I'm aware of, sir. Alright, we'll go ahead and route fire, get uh, the medical opinion on it. Be advised, if I can get someone to 10-1, I'd appreciate it, as I'm busy with the first aid at this time. Go ahead, Fox. Go ahead. Fox 1, go ahead. Uh, Fox Fox I'm sorry, we're there's limited stuff I can do here, just due here to the level of burns land, that you've got on you. 39, Fox 1, I can 10-1. Alright, 10-4, if you can do so. 10 4. Oh, shit. Right. Hang tight here, Stanford. This isn't nice when you're looking at treating one of your own here. Take this. Yep, I got it, mate. Just leave it, but. Yep, I've got it, mate. Just leave it by leave it by your side for now. Two thirty six. Go for two thirty six. Yeah, medical on route. Ten four, many thanks. Be advised, uh, he's gonna have sixty percent of his body currently burnt. I've got a uh, grab bag out, currently prepping for burns treatment. Two level will be in route down that way. Uh, two yep. Two order two two four divas, I believe. Uh, the mail. Oh come on, I got it. I believe the mail that, that crashed his car the first time, it, it probably got counted to it. If you just wanna. Uh... Ten and four. I'll be ten. All right, what order we got? Be advised, I heard an explosion, then panic button activation from 233. He's going to have um, burns over 60% of his body. Both his right leg and right arm are broken at this time, and there's a lot of blood coming from his right arm. No tourniquet applied yet, just currently know. working on burns at the minute with aloe vera packs, and uh, starting to get to work on bleeding. Did you clock that? Okay. Uh, be advised, he's what injuries do we say we got again? He's got, he's got burns to 60% of his body. Uh, right arm and right leg are yeah. broken. Right arm is bleeding heavily. Negative. At this time, yeah. I have aloe vera packs on as many burns as I possibly can get him on. As well as this, he's going to have uh, O2 applied at 20 liters per minute on cylinder at this time. Where the hell did you get an O2 bottle yeah. from? A uh, grab bag. From, uh, hey, we grab also bag have from, stuff in the 24-7 uh, I can go get. Yeah, Fong, if you can get me... Uh, few bottles of water to help with any assisting burns um, and let's go ahead and yep, I'll also grab some alcohol that's it cheers right. mate alright with the level of burns I just leave them I don't I don't want to try and irritate any of that stuff 
Yeah, Roger. Just wrap him best just you can. Would you like me to route that way as well? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm reluctant Anyways. to get water over him just yet. Just because of, obviously, yeah. us being in the snow. And I don't want to get a foil blanket okay. over him. I got water and rubbing alcohol. Nice one, mate. Uh, just leave the rubbing alcohol for the time being, because that's just going to aggravate the burns. Um, let's just slowly apply water. And if he starts getting cold, let's uh, go ahead and get a um, foil blanket around him. Yep, who's down currently? This is Stanford, mate. Oh, shit. Yeah, because right, I currently check have his a... Vitals and airway, then. Yeah, because I currently have no eyes on him currently, if you know what I mean. Oh, okay. That's weird. Uh, yeah. shield after this, I do want to talk to you, but right now I want to focus on him. Yeah, roger that. Uh, be advised, I've also hey, got uh, Stanford's body cam on my person. I clear to go? Okay, I'll that's fine. We can worry about that. Yeah, uh, Gervais, if you could work on um, the right leg, I'm going to get to work on the right arm here. Um, Block, if you're happy just to uh, check, just maintain his airway uh, if airway's needed. clear. Yeah, airway's clear. Pulse is low, however. Um, for the meantime, let's work on wrapping these burns. Don't put too much water on them. I don't want to irritate them. They're, they're pretty bad burns. Um, yeah, I'm going to slowly possibly, possibly. put some water. I wouldn't even bother. Uh, I think medical should be here. Medical yeah, that's medical. Yeah, that's medical. Yeah. They'll, yeah, they'll deal with that stuff. I'm just going to wrap the oh, burns for now. Fuck that. Um, All right. Don't worry, mate. We will do. We'll get it docked at the station oh, and uh, download the download the data. Hey, guys, we got we got oh. right, guys. Davis, it's on fire. Ah, shit. Uh, not on my spectacles. Oh yeah, that, that uh, uh, I that's weird. Um, All right, I got some of these burns wrapped up. Okay. Ah, uh, shield, yeah, you know, I'm more of the injuries for the most part. Delta yeah, Delta it's going to be Deputy, uh, Deputy Stanford. Right. He's been involved in some sort of RTC or explosion at the pumps. He's got burns over 60% of his body. Right hey, leg and right go arm are you know broken I mean. at this time. And he's got some uh, bleeding coming from the lower right arm at this time. We've secured an airway and just treated oh, yeah. on the burns as best we possibly can with uh, water and ga gauze and aloe vera packs at this time. Alright. John. Six there's a unit with their siren on. I can yep. hear it and I'm not All right, bad. Try not to speak too much, alright? Hey, uh. It's You'll be alright, Mike. Yep. I gotta go take a run around the block, if you know what I mean. That's fine, go for it. Yeah, I'll be back. Alright, I wrap some of the burns in gauze while I didn't get to finish up. Uh, last I checked his pulse, it was around uh, 20 BPM. Um, and airway was clear. I'm checking his pulse right now. Okay. Yeah, oh, that was the last pump, so. Javis, where are where are we at with his uh, with his leg? Uh, wrapping them. Okay, have you put in a in a splint just in case? Yeah, give me one and then I'll, I'll put in a splint. Yeah, just uh, pull one out from uh, Medic 5 if that's okay with the paramedics. I got some splints on me. You should have some in your uh, gear as well. Yeah, Rog. Yeah, it's, it's in the truck. Yeah. Okay, well I got my bag on me, so I got okay. some splints here. Rog. Not very big right, ones, Davis, but... Alright, Davis, want to go in the medic get the burn blanket out. We're going to need to get him on that. Alright, Javis, just uh, be careful when applying a splint. Make sure uh, his leg's not burned up too bad. Is, uh... Yeah. Although, otherwise, I'd leave it. Uh, it's better broken leg than uh, making the burns right, worse. Get it Oh, here you go, John. Wrap. Alright. Alright, get it on wrap, and then we gotta put him on there. Yeah. 
Hey, uh, just so you know, all four of these pumps exploded and, uh, and I think they might have hit the pumps. But yeah, have fun with that. I gotta. You ain't dying on a Stanford. Just chill out. We're gonna get you sorted out in, in into pillbox ASAP, mate. You're gonna be okay. Uh, Sarge, just so you're aware, um, I've got Stanford's body cam on me. He's, trying, he's, he's pushing me quite hard to review it. So when we get back to uh, San Diego, alright, we'll review it after. Yeah, Rog. Thank you, Sergeant. Alright, so what we need to do real quick, we need to get a burn blanket. Alright, we all need to lift slowly and get them on. Okay. All right. Alright, on a count of three, we'll lift them. Okay. One, two, three. Alright, now we can get the backboard over here. Uh, striker out, and let's get him on. Rog. Yeah, I'll help you with the striker. Well, the you. Uh, Alright, okay. let's get it. Alright, we got the striker out. Alright, let's lift him on there. One, two. Okay. Yeah, do strap because uh, of the burn. Back. I'll medic. provide you guys an escort down there. Now we we'll be going to pillbox. Yeah, Alright. Alright, Stanford, hang tight, buddy. Well, let me pull out my uh, camera and start doing this thing. Here, Javos. Hmm. Um, here, can you take Stanford's body camera at some point and review it on the uh, with the medical? Uh, Wait a second. Sorry. Yeah, Sarge, that's my vehicle. Shh, I have the same truck as Park <laughs> over here. I'm slightly dumb. Don't worry. Uh, yeah, um, we're gonna have to move one of those trucks. Or yeah, we'll. Uh, oh, oh. Move. oh Jesus! I know. Stand forth. I take a truck. Yep. I'll uh, go get, get my now. Road. Yep. Hey, uh, deputy. This isn't the truck really to be racing ahead with a mid fucking helper. Be on you, alright? Stay lingo. Mm -hmm. 236 County, show me transporting, uh, sorry, escorting Medic 59 to uh, Pillbox Medical. 208, you can show me same traffic. County Tango 220, can I get County Tow out here for a burnt out sheriff? Whiskey 2 we will be breaking off, we will be returning to Nate here.
So for a stop and just before the U tool, we're gonna to be in between non marker F. Go ahead and get two times additional for a couple. Two twelve. Two thirty nine. Charlie two oh three is already in around. We can step down one of those. I mean, as we can step down both of them, we'll let Metro come up here and assist us since they were primary. If we can have a unit stage. Uh, maybe around mom marker golf and set up spikes just in case we does it. Thank you. Thirty nine copy. I'll flip around here in a second. Sam two hundred four. You said you're right before the U tool. Uh, I'm gonna be right after it headed northbound. We're gonna be in between mom marker E and. I copy. Blaine County Sheriff's Office. Anyone inside? Away. We're coming up to the entrance to the highway near Mount uh, Marker Golf. Then, if you'd like us to stage in that area, that's okay. report for your side. Is this your view? 10 4, that's gonna be the car. Pull out after him. Not sure if you saw me, but he took off as soon as I copy. He did uh, take off from me. Solid. I'll be coming up to your passenger side. Delta 239, Whiskey 208, be advised I'm going to be just south, just north of Copy. Sam 204, if he takes off, I'm going for tire shots. 10 4, we have spikes now with them. Zero seven, zero four. There's a passenger. Copy. Sam two forty. Let me get in contact with the passenger. Send more if you want to go. County. 224 foot pursuit, Cluck and Bell, bank robbery suspect. We're going to be inside Cluck and Bell at the 202. I'm at 1001. Come that way. 39. I'm going to be at 2052. I'll be heading that 224. Kaiser deployment. Three four nine two zero two. Go ahead. Do you have an air unit available? 28 are you available? Uh, 10 we can break here. <laughs> Sam 4, whenever they clear that code 5, stop, go ahead. Uh, 10 4, what are we gonna be requested for? Reference the latest 911 call, air unit. 10 4. 204, 2 in custody from, uh, Kofa. Or do I have any units? I'm not to help me. 39. Show me 23 to 24. What's your location? That's what I'm going to be inside through the front. Uh, where the 
processing facility is. I've got one at gunpoint. Two thirty six, please show me uh ten six to get a witness statement at this time from station seven. Be advised I will be off comms. Uh, if anyone needs me please text. Whiskey two oh eight will be in route to Sandy Shores Airfield to grab box shot one. This is uncomfortable. Rear docks. Hey, oh, guys. Hey, old oh, Jill. Right, sorry hey, to be. You open yourself. Yeah, evidently one of you guys aren't if I'm down this way. Right, um, Rip, it's in your own steam. Do you feel ready to give a statement yet, or do you need some more time? Because if you know, if you if you if you need more time, I'm happy to sod back off to county. You can come to Sandy SO under your own steam. No, I'd rather get it over and done with. Yeah, okay. Alright, well, um, we can do yeah, it here or we can do it in the Silverado. Your choice. Hey, Shield, just before you do that, if I can just have a quick chat with you. Uh, yes, mate. Let me just see what... Rip, uh, where would you rather? Station or Silverado? I feel like I can do it better with the boys around me. Yep, no, that's not a problem. I'll quickly have a word with Moss here and then uh, we'll... Get the uh, report done. All right, Moss. Take me to your leader. All right. All right. We'll go back around the behind the. Ocean's door, not right? around. <laughs> yeah, that's a good Who's thing these ocean? days, right? Yeah, I was gonna. I was yeah, gonna Glenon's say, not around. Ocean, it's that way. Cheap. All right. All right. All right. What's up? Just so you, obviously. You already got my text message. Yes, mate. About him having done this before. Oh yeah, well we, so I just we were booking to let you it. Bear that in mind. Yeah. No, we were booking it. We were absolutely and booking it also, down Panorama. You weren't. You were on as fire and rescue at the time. But do you remember that mass active shooter call with the guys with sniper rifles, four officers down call? Yes. He was running up the Los Santos freeway. In the median. I had a feeling Meaning it would be him. That's why I of traffic. I had a feeling it would be him because I tried to get Medic 59 to divert on the way, and um, and he uh, uh, John told me no, we got to get to these officers well, down. And I I tell you what, I had a feeling it would be him. Yeah, it is. So I just asked what you bear that in mind, all right? But right. Um. <laughs> In which case, I might need to get a statement off of you as a witness statement in regards to in regards to that. Not now, but at a later stage. Yeah. Um, who was also just be aware the yep. person who actually spotted him is two oh eight. So I'm got one. Right. Perfect. I just heard it all over the radio channel. Right. Give me one second, mate, because what I'm gonna do is I'm going to write all this down and then I'll chase up leads to palm off to investigations at a later date. So we've got... So we got Ripley. Don't tell her this, mate, but she's at the minute. She's a suspect. Not going to treat her like one, obviously, because we know we know the Cirques. But at this time, she is a suspect. Yeah. Or obviously, offender. Investigation, I understand, but yeah. I'm not going to say anything. And, uh, um, James, Tyler, victim, uh, Sergeant McLaughlin, uh, 
Declan, witness to highway incident. Okay, okay, um, and he, were you a witness to the highway thing as well, or was Ripley, because apparently, uh, I believe Ripley was the one that called it in, um, wasn't she? The, oh. No, that was 208 McLaughlin. Okay, because I heard it come over the radio from uh, Ripley, saying that there was a kid running on the freeway. Yeah, I think she might have, I'm not 100% sure, I was on the LZLE at the time. Also, just be aware, since his father was basically shot and killed by SO, he's not been in a good state of mind. I know his father was pronounced dead because I'm the one that pronounced him dead myself. Right, okay. So, James possibly got a... Uh... And that was at the totally tattoo. Right, okay. So, James probably got a negative look to SO at this time. Yeah, just be aware of that. Actually, no, yeah, his dad... Be was an abusive oh yeah I understand that SOB, mate. if you can't try and mean him yeah yeah no I, I understand that um but yeah what we'll do is we'll uh yeah I'll tell you what mate let's get this now unfortunately the other person who went hang on mate hang on hang on hang on and those yeah. just real quick who was with Ripley in medic 5 when she hit Tyler was it Corey because I remember Corey yeah right yeah. okay so Corey will be an eyewitness in this. Witness. Okay, and it's going to be RTC Medic 5 versus Pedestrian. Sorry, Moss, what were you going to say? Also, okay, uh, a couple more things. Yes, mate. Uh, give me a second. Okay, so the blade that was found in his leg. We know about you that. Remember the fact that he carries a pocket? Yep, yeah, he obviously yeah. carries a pocket knife that's going to have snapped in his pocket and gone through into his leg. Yeah, was that lethal or was that, is he okay because of that? Because he's going to make a full recovery in two to three weeks at this Thank time. fuck for that. Brilliant. Okay, well that's good news. Um... What, any anything else or because I mean I'm I don't want to keep yeah, Ripley uh, waiting. You too obviously long, already know. Yeah, I understand, bud. The emergency contact. She already knows everything about what's happened with the dad. And the other individual who was on that scene, you're not able to speak to unfortunately because he's still in ICU, and that's firefighter Wolf. He basically died in the back of a squad car. Wolf. Still in ICU at the moment. Yeah, Wolf. Fuck. Medic 5 RTC transporting G who got shot in the neck twice. Got oh hit by God. a local that crossed in front of him on GOH and it collapsed both his lungs. Oh my God. What the hell? Right, well, this is, yeah, this is going well at the, at the minute. I'm just making you aware of everything I can, bud. Yeah, no, I appreciate it. Um, so, was Wolf transport transporting Gervais? At the time, yeah, he was the driver. At the, of hang on, at the time of what, though? At the time of this, this shooting where three officers went down? No. I'm saying that so that you understand why Wolf is in the ICU. Oh, right, I was going to say. Speak to him. Right, okay, no dramas. Okay, yeah, right, let's go and uh, talk to Ripley and uh, keep her out. And, um, right. Not keep her waiting, mate. That and you, then you can get back out on patrol. Yeah, exactly. If shit pops off, you've got my number, just call me. Yeah, of course, mate, of course. Uh, I own the building, the business is co owned by. Well, was COC when I was there. What what was co-owned so when you I, were there, Rip? Uh, Station 44. Oh, was that the new bar that opened up? 
It will be next week at some point. Yeah. Hey. Excuse me. Quick answer. question. Oh Christ. Oh uh, McCord. Yes. Um, quick you... answer. Who do you need, McCord? Any of you? Any of you guys see a uh, black filter come by? No, we've been no, back we've here. Been next service system chief. What? If I see anything though, I'll give you a shout. Stay away. Oh yeah, I was gonna ask, what are you doing down here? Uh, I'm currently getting a witness statement off of two firefighters down in McCord. What'd you say? Currently getting two witness statements off of uh, firefighters down here in regards to an RTC that happened in the county. Okay, well I gotta get back on the road. Alright, stay All safe. Right, take care McCord. See you later McCord. Oh, I'm so glad he didn't ask questions. Yeah, don't worry, I would've, <laughs> I would've kept it. Seems like he's busy. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I, you don't have yeah. anything to worry about anyway, Ridley. Yeah. Um, look, I'll get the ugly stuff out the way first. Um, obviously, I know the circs of it, but just for due process and investigation, um, at this moment in time, uh, you are an offender in the collision. Obviously, everyone here, including myself, totally, you know, we're, we're on your side. But as as a deputy, I have to remain. Um, impartial to the investigation with that being said um, I'm going to get a witness statement off of yourself and Corey here and then um, I'll have to pass it on to someone in traffic or someone on investigations because obviously with me working with you guys on a part time basis I can't be involved in the investigation however at the least I can do is get a statement uh, with you um, is there anything you need to say before we start this statement at all Rip? None, I understand completely and will abide by any and all laws. Okay, fantastic. Right, um just before we get just before we get into uh questioning, I will caution you. Um you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be held against you in a court of law. If you uh wish to have an attorney present with you during questioning, that's not a problem. All you have to do is ask and that right is concurrent throughout the process, okay? If you can't afford one, which I'm sure you can being a firefighter, uh one will be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas. Okay. With these rights in mind, are you still happy to talk to me? Yes. Okay. And uh, you understand your rights at this time? I do. Okay. Fantastic. Um, right. Let's start with your uh, full name, please, Rip. Obviously, I know it, but I need it for the witness statement. Gary Ripley. And how do you spell your first name? of the San Andreas Fire Department. Okay, and how do you still, how do you spell your first name, please, Rip? D A R R I E. Okay, uh, your date of birth, please, Rip. would be 11th of the 7th 1986 okay dokes right just bear with me <sighs> unfortunately we don't get any of these new phones or anything that LSPD have got we're still running old school in county Okay, I'm Carrie Ripley, Firefighter 12 of San Andreas Fire and Rescue Service. 
I've been read my rights and I'm willing to cooperate with the investigation fully. This is, this is a first account of an incident that took place at approximately 0430 on the 21st of January 2020. Okay, Rip. Um, when you're ready, just go ahead and start from the, start from the beginning where you were driving down East Joshua. So from where you've turned off of uh, Marina onto East Joshua, everything in as much detail as you can possibly remember. Just, Rebecca, are you uh, allergic to anything? This is a true. This is a true account, to the best of my knowledge. Of my knowledge. All right. So what we're gonna do? All right, is we're gonna put some oxygen you can just on do me you. A favor, just sign at the uh, bottom of this here, normal, okay. and then um, I'll get that far through when I get back to station. Also, you know, one thing I've just Cheers, remembered. Right, oh, yeah. uh, Davis, if you can turn that O2 on to high. On the investigation. Yeah. What's up, Moss? Remember, All right, Becca, what I'm going to need you to do is um, take nice, easy breaths, deep real deep, in and, and out, okay? Quality. Just let that O2 Yeah, I've already, I've already included that, mate. Um, yeah, yeah uh, nor did I see any reflection or indication from the victim that he was suddenly crossed the road, so, uh, like, indicating that he's got dark clothing on at the time, but I'll I'll tidy it up once I get to... Um, you said you're not allergic to anything, Once I get to the, um, yeah, so. the station. Um... Who we got here? Is this Hendo? Okay. That's Corey there. Corey? No, Hendo's up front. Okay, no worries. Um, right, uh, I'll get a witness statement off of you to Corey, uh, just briefly. Um, if Hendo wants to file one as your shift supervisor, he doesn't have to, but it's absolutely fine. But at the minute, it's just because you two were there at the time the incident happened. So, uh, yeah. What were we in the hospital for? Um, well, at this time, when I got back here, I had Hindu pull the uh, dash cam out of Medic 5. Oh, and brilliant. He's got it locked up in his office somewhere. Oh, fantastic. <clears throat> For you. Oh, that, that's brilliant. Um, Moss, can you ask Hendo if uh, you can get me that, please, mate? And I'll uh, get that checked through as well. E For... Uh, for uh, uh, evidence. Yeah. Actually, so what I'm going to have him do you're, you're is when he's finished dealing with, with, with this PT, I'm going to have him email you the dash cam footage. Yep, that spot on my... probably on your computer at the station. Okay, well just relax for a few minutes. Let, yeah. that, let that O2 just breathe yeah, in spot and out like we talked no about. No dramas. Uh, right, okay. Um, Corey, can I just go ahead and get your full name, please, mate? Yeah, Rebecca, first do you have name a date of birth? Sam, common spelling, S-A-M. Is that Last Sam or Samuel? Corey. Is that uh, Sam or Samuel? Actually, just, you know what, Sam. Rebecca, while you're, just Sam. while you're cool. taking in that O2, if you just hand me, like, do you have a license you can hand me? What's your date of birth, please, Corey? Can we, can we walk back that way some more? Yeah, of course, mate. Rip, for fuck's sake, get Look. a cup of tea in your love. <laughs> right. Already have. Yeah. Right, Corey, if we just come to... front there, if you know what I mean. Yeah, no, I got you. Let's just uh, come over to Silverado. Okay. Uh, yeah, that works. Yeah, what's your, what's your date of birth, please, bud? And then I radioed to have a second firefighter come up because I knew she was shaking. She wasn't even getting out of the ambulance. Sergeant Young. Hello, over uh, yonder. Oh. Spider on the foot. Oh. Let me get my badge out of my trunk. No, I was asking about what brought you guys to the city. Oh. I don't know what happened earlier. Yeah, no, sorry to... I know it's sort of trudging on, so I just don't mean to. Um, we've had a RTC that's happened up in the county involving a uh, kid, um, and unfortunately, Medic 5 was the offending vehicle, so I've had to come down and get a witness statement off of the crew of Medic 5 while it's still fresh in their minds, but I'll be heading back up to county now, get out your guys' as her. Yeah, so, yeah, the main concern was that obviously your CSC apparently didn't know about it, and then none of wow. us here knew you were coming into the city. So. Uh, well, I definitely, I definitely well, radioed I it through. 
yeah, I've definitely radioed it through, so, uh, yeah, someone wasn't paying attention, my, me thinks. But, uh, yeah, yeah, I'll, uh... Oh, I guess I'm cool. I just might have cleared up on your end. Yeah, nice one. Appreciate it, Sarge. Wrong. Chief, do you need anything from me, or yeah, are you no, cool? No, Did they have pizza I'm good. Right. Did I get that right? Say again, sorry. They had pizza inside. Yeah, yeah. There's pizza going inside, mate. Fill your boots or your face. Right, yeah, fill your boots or your face, whichever, whichever works. One of them called me in looking for you, and I was like, "Well, I think I see a truck behind the station, so I'll go swing around and check that out." Yeah. So. You're, you're oh, dude, I've still got to do another. Yeah, appreciate it. I've still now got to do another witness statement in relation to the same incident, but regarding a different matter, if that makes sense. I've got to talk to the uh, the victim of this incident's mother because she she was worried that he's gone missing. So it's all oh mate, it's coming down like a ton of bricks on me at the minute. And and on top of that, Stanford managed to that. go ahead and get himself blown up. So he's in pillbox, which is why I couldn't get. The mother's statement done first, so yeah, I've got a lot of chasing up to do at the minute. <sighs> I can feel that, man. Yeah. Okay, I'll let you get to it. I'll be yeah. around if you need anything, alright? Appreciate it, man. Take care. You too. Uh, uh, what will we do without you, Rip? Join the sheriff's office, they said. It will be fun, they said. Ugh. Alright. You lot, stay out of trouble, otherwise, right. I've got more paperwork on my hands. All right, I'm shield. I'm gonna grab my 14 <laughs> charger out, and I'll be 97 back up to jurisdiction. Okay, mate. You sure you don't want to lift, or are you good? I was gonna say, why would you I just get in 14. with him and pick your vehicle up there? Because I've got my 14 parked in the garage. Oh, I'm saying, I think he's got parked out back up there. there. Yeah. What? Makes sense. All right, I'm gonna. Uh... All right, I'll see you up there, shield. Yeah, Roger, mate. Nom, nom, Take care, nom, guys. Nom. Uh, yo. That sergeant, all right. Sounds like he's having an orgasm. Yeah, yeah I think he's just he's eating happy. food. Yeah, sounds like he's uh, getting a little too excited about it. <laughs> two thirty-six back on the air. Two thirty-six. Shots fired. Four zero two four. Ten four. Show me responding. Code three. Can you repeat the postal, please? Four zero two four. Ten four. Show me handling. Two twenty. Ten four, stand by. I'll be going down there. They got that. I'm gonna go ahead. No, I didn't. Okay, here. Watch out, Blanche. Sorry, I'm light. Is everything under control here, or yeah, you okay. still need, still need me? Ah, uh, it's all good now. She okay. learned her mistake by trying to open fire, and then I shot her. So. Oh yeah, that's. Motherfucker, never... you all shot right. at me first. Okay, where are yeah, you? Yeah, that's hit? probably because you pointed a weapon at him. I didn't do shit. They tried probably to pin me in for no fucking direct. reason. All right, all right, ma'am. Are about you going to sing the man that we shot fired? Four zero two four rounds of shooter. Shoulder, arm, it hurts, man. Ten right, four. Be advised, fires ten seven no, at this time. No, but if no, need be, I can one. be ninety seven with left, okay. a set of medical equipment. Uh, that's gonna be up to you. I can talk. What well, we got, Sarge? Ten right, four. If leave need be, I can reactivate his fire and grab medic fire. Repeat that, sorry, I had to cut oh, off my radio. This time to go 10 7, I'll just call Tempo. Uh, possibly uh, two BSWs to left shoulder and arm. 
Uh, make sure my truck stays there then, so it's uh, blocking traffic, so they don't come over and hit the. Yeah. Yes, Gervais, please. Oh, All right. Okay. So two twenty yeah. out, going to uh, the next one. go ahead and check vitals for me. And yeah, my uh, partner is gonna go ahead and check vitals. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna be county. They're gonna be here in about five mics. Go, so just do what you can here, and then we'll we'll get her out of here. Okay, shouldn't be too bad. We got uh, two GSWs. One's gonna be left shoulder, and the left arm. Uh, packing them with a clot now. I'm gonna push this on. All right, we got a high pulse. Breathing is uh even and normal. Okay. Hey, yo, folks, I'm all right to go tonight. Yeah, man, you're good. All right, appreciate it. Take care, guys. Yeah, you too. You Stay too. safe. Always. All right, man. It's gonna be 10, 15 times one insane. Oh, wait, we have a, 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 a 236. And, and for I'm on 911. I can have another unit. Twenty, I got. What's your twenty? Two zero three. Lost eyes. Person is on a bike, going westbound. Yeah, what's your 2220? 
Got eyes back on the bike. 20. It'll be... Uh... Going up to the old... 2037. 10-4 on the way. Two thirty six, two twenty, keep up comms, please. Large size. Turn four. Ten eighty. Ten for it. I was. Ten four was last known. Uh. It was the. Driveway going up to the only one. And for what was the vehicle description you stated? Uh, black bicycle, mountain bike style. And for. With a rider wearing all black, wanted for aging farm buildings and life. Yeah, for Two thirty six, I've got eyes, it looks like he's gonna be heading eastbound around the two thirty six area, unknown street name. Be advised I'm uh, currently a distance away attempting to catch up at this time. Delta two twenty nine Sam. If need be, I'm on CV at the moment, heading towards main. If I can attach, if need be. 236, yeah, I've got it. eyes. Be advised, it's going to be westbound Jordan Lane. Nearest postal is going to be, be 2002. Be advised, at this time, it's 1080 failing to yield. We are going to be going westbound towards Grape Seed LTD at this time. Speed's low at this time. Uh, rider is going to be wearing all black, and it's going to be a black BMX. Turning left, 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 left at 2004 towards a barn between the uh, crop awnings. Going off road at this time, general direction southbound. It's going to be going through the fields towards the Mackenzie Airfield southbound direction of travel at this time. Two thirty six is back towards Grapeseed LTD at this time. Three forty nine two oh three. Go ahead, sir. Were you guys involved in a shooting with a Kara Briggs? Yeah, if I'm the bike! We're gonna have a 1080 actually up in the county. 236, be advised, suspect has fallen into the Alamo Sea. Stand by. 10-4-2-3, all PD units are currently on a scene with Miss Briggs. Nathan, she got out of custody? 204 to units, let's go ahead and 20. 
236, eyes on, on, eyes on. Blaine County Sheriff's Office, stay where you are. Get your hands up now. Hands up. Step out of the water. Step out of the water now towards the um, SRU off right. Guys, do not tase. Hands up. Show me your hands right now. 239, 236, advice 20. Give me covered. 236, I've got you covered to all right. 236, 239, it's going to be nearest postal 2018, Seaview Road. Two thirty six be advised two oh eight is currently affecting an arrest. Uh, can we start medical please or county medical for possible uh, cold water shock? Delta two twenty nine delta two thirty six, it's gotta be county EMS at this Jesus H Christ. Two thirty six, ten four. Here you go, Sergeant. Got my first aid kit for you. I'll go grab some Thank thermal you. blankets. I have plenty on me, boss. I have my SRU bag here. It has all my medical gear in it. Oh, okay. Yeah, Moss, don't you know that, uh... Know. Yeah, he always has it. 204 to 239, you can go down there, got 10-4! I'm gonna check Charlie two or three. I'm gonna ten one down, down the radio city wide uh, this time. Tell anything. I'm gonna yeah. clear. You something. Uh, oh, here we go. Medical necklace. That's all right. Is this the person that escaped out of the um, institute clear. at uh, Polito? No, I'm asking, is it? Oh, I have no idea. Oh, no, gosh, because I'm not sure if I'm no, it, misremembering, it but up. I'm not sure if I'm misremembering, oh, but I yep, remember. Oh, he's deaf. Yeah, I remember yeah. Um, hit, seeing something on the MDT about a 911 from uh, a institute in Polito saying one of their patients had escaped and they were wearing all black. So I'm not sure if this could be the person. That they were talking about. I don't know. I uh, got a gash in the back of his head. I don't know. I want to see if I can get this mask off without hitting okay. the gash there. Uh, ah, yeah, here, hold this gauze in the, in the back of his head here for a minute. I want to see if I can get this mask on. Rog. You guys need a uh, med bag? Negative, we got one. That's how you get it. Thank you. Oh, copy. I didn't see it. Hey, Kong, can you do us a favor? Yes. Yes. Up here. Uh, sorry guys, just before you go. Yeah. Yeah, can one of you just get that BMX seized for uh, evidence, please? Just put in the back yeah. of one of the trucks. Thank you. Got you. Oh, that's cold. Yeah, sorry, mate. I would explain why they didn't stop too well, but, uh, I mean, they, they saw us. They he had to see us at some point. I was right in front of him. Yeah. I mean, we can't go off the fact that he's just been dead. I mean, even that's not an excuse at this point. Yeah, agreed. When you've had, what, four units? I don't think I'm going to be able to get this mask off. Okay. So. Well, do we want to just bandage the gauze to the back of the head over the mask? Yeah, we can just bandage it, probably. Um... Leave okay. the hospital, just try and remove that. Yeah, right. Uncheck for the, any other injuries, just uh, apply some more gauze there, get some bandages around it so it stays in place. Raj, will do. Have you got any Israeli bandages at all? Uh, Israeli bandage? Oh, yeah, those things are like, they're bloody. Oh, they're just incredible for. Uh, what are they? Rapping. I might know them by a different name. Uh, oh god, best way to describe them, they've got a clip on one end with a load of padding towards that end, and then you just wrap it around and around and around and then tie it off. 
Um, and it generally is oh, it's like an ace bandage thing. Yeah, I got, like that. Yeah. I got something kind of close to that. Nice one, thank you. Yeah, here. Cheers. All right, let me grab that. Yeah, uh, get some more gauze on to it, uh, onto it there. 10, 7, 10, Hold on, hold on. I'm going to do a seizure here. Alright, tiny medic should be here pretty soon. We'll just keep him stable until then. Just try to keep his head from hitting anything else in the meantime. Yeah, right. Don't, uh, don't force him. Yo, yeah, don't force him. 10, 7, 10, 42. Switching back over to FB. Okay. Alright, so you stops. Uh, okay, stop, no. whatever. Well, I'm gonna get this wrapped up as okay, quick as yeah. possible. Alright, perfect. You do that. I'm gonna check for the injuries. Check here. See if I can get it. Check on airway or something. Roger. I must be able to move part of this mask for now. Uh, yeah. I want to see what the mask is made of. I want to see if I can cut it. Okay. Whoa. Oh shit. What the? Two eight. We got shots fired in the area. Two zero one seven. So be aware that uh, Mr. Clyde is out and he's going to be a farmer in the area and he might have had to shoot one of his cows. I'll go check up on him. Hey, boy. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to keep an eye out. Watch yourself. Yo, 229. Be advised, I'm getting a, I was getting a left back from 239 to the station. But go, go and check out the gunshot. Okay, well, the breathing seems oh, fine, please. so, yeah, okay. I'm happy with that. Hey, whoa, 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 uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy, pal. Alright, county medic should uh, be arriving here soon. Yeah, Rog. Alright, yeah. County medic's here. They'll, uh, they'll take him from here. Uh, we can get the, uh, an ID on them or something. Rog. Planning it. Two oh eight, we've got another gunshot in the area. Got Dino Dunstan here. Alright, All right. perfect. You yeah, you keep hold of that for now. Get on to two twenty back. Uh, as it was his stop. Um, okay. Probably uh, it's his Yo, discretion, it but uh, myself and it'd be two thirty nine are gonna uh, be out on shift and, uh, game. We got arrest. shots to our side. Sorry, sorry, so I'll say that last again. Uh it's probably gonna be criminal mischief and uh uh, resisting arrest. Okay, roger that. I need to go get new uniform pants. Yeah, roger.
236, go ahead, show me tonight. Code 4, that last. I'm gonna be out with Mr. Clyde two zero three. Yeah, two zero three four. You can twenty. David two thirty nine. You said shots fired. If I was gonna be a farm putting down his cow. Delta 239, Delta 236. Can you meet me at the Sandy Station? Roger 236, show me traveling. Temper, I'm gonna be about five mics out. Uh, 236, 239, could you meet me at Totally Tattoo instead, please? Hey, firm. Alright, just feel bad. Thanks. I've just changed my radio frequency to the fire ground. Two thirty six to uh, supervisor units be advised. I'm gonna be uh ten six off the air momentarily getting a victim statement from a Morgan Miller uh location. It's gonna to be totally tattoo Alhambra Drive three zero zero seven. Well, what's going on with that? Uh, it's in relation to her son James Tyler. He was struck by Medic Five in an RTC pedestrian versus uh, vehicle at the time. Uh, Morgan. Indoors, not Thank you. Um, just let you know, I've got another deputy on the way as well to <coughs> to um, I've got another deputy on the way to uh, assist in this case. Um, I'm not going to lie; I've also been monitoring uh, Twitter. There's been some uh, activity regarding James, so um, yeah, I won't go into fucking Xavier. If I'm sorry. He so much as lays a hand on James. Hang on, I'm sorry. Say say that again. Xavier, Xavier Detman. Here, let me hand you my information that I have in my tattoo appointments. Yeah, yeah, go, go ahead. Delta 239, I'm gonna be 10-6-3-0-0-7 at the totally tattoo, I'm good. Right, okay. He did do a down payment of $500. I'm sorry, say again? He put in a Hello. down payment for his appointment uh -huh. for five hundred dollars. Right. Okay. He is free to collect that payment as a refund and get the like stay the hell away from my store. Yeah. No, I completely understand. Um. Yeah. No, that's. Uh. Yeah. No, I'm a little bit shocked by that because uh, Xavier is well known to me as well, actually. Um. Mm -hmm. uh, if it's okay with you, I'd just really like to. I really don't want my boy hanging out with him. Yeah, if it's okay, um, I'd just like to quickly, you know, fill you in in regards to uh, James. Um, at the minute, um, I actually came across the incident just by chance. Um, I noticed Medic Five had their lights on on East Joshua Road when I um, when I uh, went to go and investigate. And it, it appeared to me that James had been struck by a vehicle. Turns out, um, at the minute, from what the reports are suggesting, um, from what FD are saying, James ran out into traffic without any indication and actually um, Medic 5 struck him. Uh, I'm yet to review the dash cam footage in regards to the incident. So, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to be, I'm not going to be, you know, saying what what's happened for definite at the minute 
However, um, obviously, with with this in mind, I just need to obviously keep you informed as a, as his adoptive mother now. Um, but uh, what's happened is he uh, James has taken a fairly nasty blow off of uh, the side of Medic Five, and when he's actually been hit, um, as I'm sure you're aware, he car he carries his switchblade um, on a regular basis. But that's actually snapped um, in his pocket when he's been hit that's by Medic Five. Yeah, what's up? Sorry to break the combo, but what's uh, up? hold on, come here for a quick second. I'm sorry about this, Morgan. Just bear with me. Hey, stay right here. Just stay right here. I'm gonna whisper it to you. All right, Rog. There's a. Uh, if you look out the door, straight oh. straight across the road, there's a person quite suspicious. They just walked up, and I saw a. Uh, Feed on the Twitter. If you take a look at that, you'll see that as well. Stand by. I stepped out to my. Jesus I actually like I was stepping out to my patrol vehicle Jesus. to take a. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Fun. Get that. Get on radio. Get S I U down in oh, now. Man. Get S I. Oh, we got Tell... a bell ring. Uh... No, Fong. Forget the bell ring. Tell SRU to get down here and apprehend apprehend whoever's standing outside outside of uh, here now. Um, right, we've got right. Um, where was I? Yeah, so James's James's switchblade is actually snapped in his pocket when he's um, been hit. Uh, when he's been hit by this. Um, by the medic five and it's actually gone into his leg um tourniquet was applied fairly early on and you know we haven't pulled the pulled it out or anything he, he's in the best possible condition he can be in at the minute just so you're aware he's so at I... go ahead I... you what uh hold on um he is at yeah uh, is... never mind Okay, he is at Pillbox Medical Center at the minute being treated, so you're free to go down on yeah. visiting hours. Um, go on. I actually just got back from there, so. Ah, brilliant. Okay. Um, more the doctors just... she'll be back with you in a minute. Yeah. Uh huh. Cover well since he's young. But, Hello. Uh... Yeah, of course. Okay, just um, just bear with me real quick. 236 yeah, County, can we get units, one sec, can we get nice units house. to 3007 instantly please, we believe we have a person that's made death threats against uh, James Tyler, currently outside the tattoo parlor shop, looking to make an arrest here, if we can get additionals to, uh, to assist. 204 zone. Morgan, just stay, stay in the shop for a minute. Alright. 236, 239, what's your location? Right. Xavier, keep your hands up. Xavier, get your fucking hands up now. Stop messing around. Turn around, face the building. Someone got me covered. Mm-hmm. Rog. That was not what I wanted. Right, Xavier, at this time, you're being detained for purposes of an investigation regarding uh, possible threats you've made online, okay? So you do not have to... Uh, sorry, you have the right to remain silent, but may harm you... <laughs> you have the right to remain silent, and anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney, but if you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you by the state of San Andreas, okay? Do you understand? Uh, you have at any time, at any time you have the right Charlie to request your you law lawyer. Um, at any time you have the right to request your attorney. Um, and these rights are concurrent throughout the process, okay? If you can't afford an attorney, one will be provided to you by the state of San Andreas. Do you understand your rights? Just nod yes if you understand. 
Right, okay, and with these rights in mind, are you happy to uh, still talk to me? Again, nod yes or shake your head no, if you understand. Alrighty. Right. Okay, just sit tight in here for a minute. Good, good save shield, I heard that. Yeah, Rog. Alrighty, so I do believe Deputy Shield has informed you of everything that's going on. 236 County, be advised. We've uh, got 11015 at um, this time. Not entirely no, but. Alright, so you do know about uh, James being done, pillbox, and all that kind of stuff before I had to yeah, uh, take I, off quickly. Uh, I visited him. That's good. How's he doing? I haven't been down there recently. <laughs> Doctors are hopeful for his recovery. That's good. Fong, I'll be down the road if you need me, just to keep out of air shot. Copy. Alright, so... I need to speak to about my, right. to my uh, superiors about this, right. but I do believe that you are possibly going to be able to get your fong. Right, now that we're out of air shot. Right, Xavier, don't mess me about. I've been monitoring the Twitter threats that's been going on between you and Morgan. Okay. Um, at the minute, we know about we know about the uh, we know about um, obviously your and James's uh, that you two are acquaintances, if you can call it that, and we are currently investigating that. Okay. Um, at this time, you're going to be detained for the purposes of an investigation regarding these online threats. Um, and you will be pending investigation on that, okay? Yeah, well, I'm sorry, but it's kind of stupid when you go around making threats online, okay? For everyone to see, okay? Um, unfortunately, uh, we've managed to get to James Tyler first before you have. So, um... You know he, he he's in he's on under our care at this time. Uh, you're not going to get anywhere near him until we've concluded this investigation. Right. You be honest with me. Have you got anything any conflict regarding James? Just nod your head yes or shake your head no. Two thirty six, two thirty nine. Go for it. Be advised, I've just seen someone heading southbound, just about a block east towards Turley Tattoo. Be on guard. Right, stop. Right, stop pulling aggressively, otherwise I'll just place you in the back of my truck. Okay. So, it, choice is yours. In fact, no, actually, you know, I'm not, I'm not happy with this now. I'm gonna hold on. If you could do me a favor, I'm gonna be sending a uh, email to your business email. All right. Perfect. Oh, I hope. Is that the guy? Right there. Uh, yeah. You, if you free, just to uh, quickly come over for a word, please, Captain. Just need some advice on this. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I stay here for a second. I'll be back. All right. Hey, Captain. I just came to back you up because you said it was a suspicious person. I was like, all right. Well, no, appreciate it. Now, so. Um, I'll be honest. At the minute, it's fairly early on in an investigation. Um, but um, I'm not sure how how far away you are of it. So I'll try. I'll try run you through it in chronological order as best I can from what information I've already got. Um, okay. right. it started off, I believe, with a 911 coming in from Morgan. Seven. No, sorry. Yeah, go ahead, Fong. I have the reports ready if I, if I, you need me to state them all. Perfect. Just stand by with that, um, and I'll get, I'll pass it over to you in a moment. Um, sorry, it's not come through with a 911. Yep. 
um, I've noticed in the distance, probably from around this area actually, Medic 5 had its lights on stationary on East Joshua Road. Now, to my knowledge, they just left Sandy SO um, petrol station after filling up, so I'm thinking, well, what's what's the issue? Um, wandered over there, and as I'm approaching, noticed the kid just in the middle of the road who I, I know to be James Tyler, and uh, Medic 5's actually um, hit him. They say that um, he's run out without any indication. It's been dark, snowy conditions, all that sort of stuff. Um, I'm yet to review this dash cam footage. It's yet to be released by FD Command about that, so um, I'm waiting to, to hear back from that. However, then uh, I've been in contact with Miss Miller here, who's um, texted me saying that uh, James has gone missing, literally just after Medic 5 have transported James Tyler off to pillbox. Um, so I've then <clears throat> come to fill her, fill her in about this. I've already got uh, first account reports from the two uh, FD members in uh, Medic 5 at the time. It's come to my attention that there is some sort of argument or conflict now going on, and get this, there's some sort of conflict going on between Xavier Detman and James Tyler, so... Oh, lovely. Yeah, exactly. Um, I don't know what they're arguing about or anything like this, which is where I'm going to pass it to Deputy Fong, because, Fong, you've probably got more in on this than I do. Uh, what is that? Jesus. What is that? Uh, the, the report what you've got. Talking about? I'm sorry, I just had a... Oh, yeah. Uh, give, give me a second. You're all right, mate. Uh, yeah, I, I emailed you both about maybe five, ten minutes ago, if you could check that. Uh, oh, okay. Rog. All right. Well. Uh. So, Xavier Detman's in the back of your car or something? Yeah, he's in the back of my car. He's been patted down. He's only had a switchblade on him, which is still on the still okay. on the bonnet of my so... truck. At the minute, I've got him detained, right, but I've monitor. I, I, I've got. I've actively been monitoring threats he's made between Morgan Miller and himself. A conversation that he's had, and he's been making threats about coming to repay, um, you know, repay some sort of debt or something like that. Just basically suggesting violence upon James or Miller. Um, when I've actually done okay. a victim statement off of Miller in regards to the RTC James was involved in, Fong's with me and he's noticed Xavier actually outside across the street. At which point I've told him, right, get SIU down here, get an, an effect and arrest on this guy. Um, and then Xavier's been out here, Wade's come to back me up, because I think Fong ran off in the wrong direction thinking Xavier had gone off somewhere else. No, I, somewhere else. I went to go talk to you, Sergeant, uh, Sergeant McLaughlin. Oh, right, okay. Um, yeah, but I've essentially had Xavier at gunpoint, Wade's backed me up, and I've, been af I've, if I've detained Xavier at this time, but to arrest him, I'm wondering what sort of charges I can bring on him in terms of online threats. Um, pretty much a whole lot of nothing. Right. We don't really got anything against it. So, what's gonna happen is we're gonna criminally trespass. I mean, we can hit, we can... Here, where's, where's, uh, Miss Miller? Mr. Yeah, Miss Miller? Miller's I'll still inside her. the shop. Okay. Uh, Fong, it's probably best if we so come inside, to just thing. to, yeah, just to avoid. Fair point. Yeah, it's snowing. Well, and the fact that we don't want Xavier seeing right. her or getting ideas. Funny? Oh, he's okay. just, um, I, I don't know. Okay, uh, yeah, Morgan, this, this is... This is my captain, Hi. Captain Valentine. He's the uh, active supervisor yep, monitoring the case. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Okay. All right. So perfect. So this is what's going to happen, uh, Miss Miller. Um, it's going to be a few things. Okay. So one, do you want that uh, Xavier Detman criminally trespassed off your property at this time? Does that mean he can never come back here? Yes. Then yes. Okay. Perfect. The other thing. Awesome. You'd have to go to court for this, but it would basically, you, you would get a, a restraining order against an individual uh, at any point during time, not just the building, right? So if you're down the street or whatever, um, you, you, would, you would have that restraining order of whatever, how many feet that they, they set it at and stuff like that, um, that you would have to get filed through with the court system. Um, but for right now, we're going to hit Xavier Dentman with criminal trespassing. Um, on a 
private property since this is a store that you own. Um, you're not renting this property out, correct? Nope, it's mine. Okay, so yeah, so it's gonna be we're gonna be hitting him with with trespassing on private property. Uh, he'll be taking in, uh, taken in uh, uh, to jail tonight, and then you need to go to the court systems within a few days here and get a restraining order uh, for you and your son, James Tyler, or is it? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, so get one for both of you, right? Uh. Um, after that, if you have any problems, mm -hmm. if you notice that Xavier Detman is following you, uh, you know, disobeying the um, restraining order in any way, shape, or form, uh, he goes back to jail every single time. Uh, eventually, it becomes a, a felony problem. Um, it's, it's pretty much three strikes, you're out kind of thing when it comes to restraining orders, which then means that it, it's a felony and he'll be going to jail for a while, okay? All right. All right, perfect. Um, all right, gentlemen. Uh, Captain, with res oh, yeah, Captain. Really need for me. Uh, yeah, just a couple of things. I'm just mon you. I'm just monitoring the Twitter accounts, and um, mm -hmm. Xavier is actively making threats on Twitter, saying that we may just have to brawl. Uh, I'm coming for more than my money. Uh, I'm coming for my money and the kid. He's make you know he's making active threats of violence. There is there literally nothing we can do in regards to that at all. I really know. Raj, okie dokes. Unless you want to, hey. unless you want to try to send it up through the county department of homeland security and have them trying to deal with it, but and that's that's, I mean, even that's even above investigations pay grade. <sighs> right. Okay. No worries. Yeah, maybe we have a word I mean, outside. We're literally dealing with something that would be a county, you know, department of homeland security or whatever it may Please. be. Um, yeah. I would have to deal with the situation. That's yeah, that's probably more um, the uh, sheriff's. Um, that's more probably more the sheriff's area of expertise. If you catch my drift. Yeah, yeah. So you know, I can I can give the, the piece of advice that I just gave to Miss Miller, and that's all we can do for the night. Uh, so book Xavier Detman for uh, criminally trespassing on private property tonight, and um, okay. get him in, in it, get him into a cell for the night. Yeah, perfect. Well, at least we got him on some. Captain, may I have a word with you outside quickly? Somewhere. Uh, sure. All right. All right, Morgan. Um, not the result I would have liked to hope, but at least we've, you know, we steered him off your property for the time being, because I think uh, I, I believe he was about to. Well, there was an imminent threat to life, or at least threat to harm there. Um, like I say, I would oh, get the. Uh, I would get that. Um, that. Court. Uh, the, sorry, that restraining order by the court's done ASAP. Um, it is. It can usually be done fairly swiftly, so before Xavier will be released tomorrow. Um, but unfortunately, there's nothing else I can really uh, get get in with at the minute, even though these are active threats online. That's fine. I appreciate it. All right. No dramas. Is there um? Is there anything else you need from me? Re James versus Medic Five or James versus Xavier. I mean, if I really need anything, ask for like the medical doctors. But thank you. Yeah. No. Anytime. Okay. Um. Well. Yeah. If you were, uh, if you need me, obviously you've got my number. I'll uh. I'll um be around. Like I say, obviously, I would have hoped to be around sooner. But one of our deputies decided it'd be a good idea to uh smack himself yeah. up they and drive into the petrol pumps yep, so uh yeah we had to go deal with that uh quickly is he okay at least or oh he's in hey he's in uh, pillbox uh, he's in uh he's in a critical but stable condition i'm sure he'll pull through for sure well that's good all right miss miller, um, miss miller. stay safe have we got K9 on at all uh, i it's think the coyotes. so uh raj okay <laughs> captain can you hear them? They sound like little yappers. So, uh, Look, ready, listen. Oh. That was not a yapper. Oh. Oh. Two roll fours. We're gonna be here. Why are you petting the coyote? Why are you harassing him? I, I, I don't know. <laughs> there we go. Honestly, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I think, right. I think uh, it's so, just clicked Miss Miller, I have just been informed by the captain that I am allowed to give back your firearm to you. I will be going to grab that from the station. Alright, awesome. 
yeah, brilliant. Yeah, due to the circumstances, actually, that would that would definitely help. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> honestly, I, I wouldn't be conservative if it's Xavier. He's well known to us, and um, he, he goes against every bit of advice we try to give him. <laughs> so, yeah. So um, you're saying he's basically a criminal type? Uh, it seems that way. Um, he, he is known to be in a gang of some kind, but he's very reserved on that. Um, no matter how much, how many times we try to pry it out of him, um, but so, it, it's so probably the two people that were trying to help me find James earlier. Awesome. Yeah. Oh. I like this. By like this, I mean this is very stressful. Yeah. Honestly. Sir, oh, I can't this... say that the tattoo shop's actually open. Please get out. Oh, daggone it! I needed me a tattoo. Need something American. <laughs> that's that's Clyde. Oh, he's man, well known to us as well. He, he's out. He's out. Uh, by yeah, the the tattoo seat. shop ain't open. Um, yeah, Xavier's but Xavier can be considered yeah, pretty dangerous to be honest. Well. In that he is just he is just shit. I'm here. I need to look American. He is full of sheer That's determination, yeah. but um, a, you know uh, we have genuinely tried to help him. I'm just gonna we have genuinely away. tried to help him, but uh, he, does, he just doesn't. You know, it, it, it's to the point now where there. we're having to enforce laws on him and prevent him from getting himself into more trouble forcefully rather than just being able to talk it through with him um in that he's that stubborn so uh yeah um yeah if, i'm not gonna be letting james hang out with his quote-unquote friends anymore yeah no no that's that's understandable um yeah obviously here's your fire on back um Thanks. yeah um, hopefully it won't yep. uh, present an issue when James comes back. Obviously he is technically still a concern of ours, but uh, yeah, we'll, I'll I'll stop rambling on now because obviously I'm sure you want to get your business back open. Um, but like Hello. I say, we uh, will. I, I, uh, I just don't hit your car by accident. You did? All right, let me check it out. Yeah, like uh, I say, we will only uh, be a phone a, call away if you need or a text away. There's no. I'm not oh, seeing anything. I appreciate it, Shield. Oh, that was it's, it. no it's over here. All right, take care, Morgan. Oh, which vehicle? Have a good uh, one. I think this was this here truck. Kind of. Oh. Yeah, hey, Shield. Jesus. Yeah, I see it. Oh, thank you. I'll call. Delta 239, oh, no, no, available no, no, supervisor. No, God damn it, Claude. You realize I've got to get my supervisor out for this now? Delta 239, available supervisor. <sighs> what are we gonna do with you, eh? Oh, I'm good. just waiting to hit the grade right. now. Can you head yeah, over to yeah, 3007 yeah. at the Totally uh, Tattoo right. reference in? Um, I really I... am sorry, officer boss oh, man. Can I have you respond? 3007 at the Totally right. Tattoo reference in and via. MVA, sir. You don't need my, my, uh, uh, my life and uh, my good gonna be, go. uh, be advised, it's gonna be Deputy Shield at this time. Uh, no, Clyde, you're alright. We, we know who you are. 10 for. Alright. All right. I'm really sorry, Mr. Officer Boss Man. I really am. Hey, Shield. Yeah, I heard mate, just get some photos. I'm doing so now. Yep, I'm gonna be grabbing my camera. Rog. Right, Funk, I'm gonna get um, Xavier to uh, Sandy SO, book him in once you're done with that. Hold on, I gotta take pictures of your vehicle. Yeah, once, once you're done I gotta... with it. She let me finish my damn sentence, boy. Right, hang on, hang on. Back up a bit, cause you're not gonna get okay. the full frame. You're not gonna get the full frame. Right. Watch it back. Watch, watch out, shield. You ready? You, you want me to take a stylus photo for you? Then I'd look out. Ow. <laughs> okay, maybe it's a bit close. 
<laughs> yeah, that was a little too close. All right, I got the pictures for you. All right, nice one, mate. Appreciate it. All right, just unlock me car. Oi! Yep. Just unlock me car. <laughs> Bro, if you better watch yourself. Otherwise, I'll set Xavier on you. Otherwise... See ya. Eh, I wouldn't. Neither would I, to be fair. Not sure if that's a good idea, Sfield. Shut up, Kong. No, you. Ass hat. Alright, come on, Xavier, let's get you uh, inside and booked. Xavier, this is all on body cam, so the more you struggle, it's just going to show that your wrists are r rubbing raw, okay? Delta 239, show me <clears throat> back to name. Alright, Xavier, let's get you. Alright, I should watch you. No? <laughs> I've got. Uh, I need to get some water. Yes, you do. These damn hiccups won't <laughs> go away. Nope. Okay, alright. Right. Wrong one, field. Doors to your left. No, I, I know of. Uh... Yeah. There you go. Nope, because now I'm stuck in it as well. Alright. It's unlocked until you get. Now, okay. Hey, uh, S <coughs> Sarge. You here? Hey, Hi. how's it going, man? Hey, uh, there's some hillbilly redneck this time, down there. Uh, you've crashed been arrested for criminal trespass. 24/7. You guys want to um, check also, it out? Also, be aware that. Uh, uh, yeah, if you wouldn't mind moving your <laughs> vehicle for me, you're blocking mine in. A court yeah. order Sorry, filed against you for. Um, yeah, thanks. You're. A restraining you're good. order against the property and the persons James Tyler, and and uh, Morgan Miller. Well. Mate, I'm not being funny. You have literally Lowry. made threats. You've literally made threats to harm. And Delta two thirty nine. Show me to route to the to life. Sandy Shore is twenty. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, what what's there to explain there? Okay, we will get James's account of things, and we will get your account of things in 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 due time. Okay. Right. Well. We will get interviews from all parties, and then uh, you'll you'll have your say, and so will James and potentially Morgan. Have you got any further questions for me before I leave you to it? Have you got any further questions, or are you just going to stand there trying to kick the cell?
Okay. Not being funny, but you can't say that Morgan's trying to steal James away from you when... Uh, when uh, technically she is his legal guardian. That's that done, guys. We're going to wrap this up here. Go 10 7 10 42 for the night. Thank you for joining me on this patrol. We have now been recording for three and a half hours overall. Um, that's the raw file. Hopefully, I can cut it down. Yeah!